Hi, Scritter here, back again for part two, this time looking at the results. It's a totally different campaign, one that's actually run. So you go into your campaigns in Google and um, make sure you've selected keywords and then um, I'll just take that off and then you want to click here to download the file. All I've done here with this keyword report is I've um, taken off the last two columns because I'm not using them. So this is the keyword again it's a small one status eligible blah blah blah, blah. Maximum, co maximum cost per click this is in dollars so it's 60 cents. Uh, number of clicks it seems very low it, and it is low however this is an incredibly high-end client whose uh, products sell for over sixty thousand dollars a time and so if they if they get five or six co um, contacts per month they are very impressed very happy with that and uh, average cost per click cost average positioning here's the one is the only real two you need to look at conversions and cost per conversion 53p for conversion okay so um, what is inventory Con which is a question it's not got a buying imperative if I hadn't analyzed this data I probably wouldn't have considered it a particularly good keyword it got 92 impressions over a month 1.9 conversion rate uh, which actually meant uh, for 53p I had somebody ringing my client up asking for a quote for 53p here, what this one here at 5,579 supply chain optimization, which seems like a far more on the nose sort of thing. It's not questioning this, but this first one, what is inventory? It seems like a questioning sort of thing. Well, why would anybody bid that? But they did. Supply chain optimization, five and a half thousand impressions, four conversions, 79 people per conversion. Uh, stock takes, uh, one, one, sorry, it's pound dollars, one, one dollar eighty nine. Uh, inventory management software which is really on the nose um, this is where we're at, uh, average position is five so this has very very high competition we're coming in at five some of these are six and seven we're coming right down the list but we're bidding pence now the average cost per bid on this according to Google is in the tens of dollars we're bidding 60 cents and for that 60 cents we've had one conversion and the overall cost for that conversion was um, $1.14 so it's two so it's actually what is it 57 cents uh, we so for an average 57 cents for a click and $1.14 for a conversion and we're doing it because we're get hitting this 0 0.6 competition level we're bidding very low and we don't mind if we're the fifth on the list uh, the last one here discontinued stock which is another bit of a pig in a poke whether that's good or not $1 and one cent so the need is you don't really need to do anything extra with this because this is after the event but what it means sometimes is what it shows me is that bidding well below as long as the competition levels is a max of 0 0.6 that's my sort of hot, soft uh, roof level that I'll go to the lower this competition the lower you can bid regardless of what it says the maximum bid should be the lower the competition is the lower you can bid so I've set my maximum competition level at 0.6 I'm not going to go and bid against anybody like that because it tends to mean there are seven or eight other advertisers against you all bidding somewhere close to the average recommended amount or higher and unless you go into that category and bid that sort of amount you're not going to get any impressions and what we've also found is over time that can ruin your account score and your landing page score how that works and how your landing page is related to the cost of your bid I don't know it shouldn't be there there seems to be a huge disconnect but we know that they are however on something like um, I mean that was cheap anyway but on something like this supply chain optimization if you check that out I think it's something like ten dollars uh, we had four at um, we, we, all right, we only position nearly at seventh place in, in Google listings we're right down the bottom but during the course of the month that converted uh, we had 5,579 impressions and four converted to actual contact uh, at an average cost of 79 cents per contact so you need to analyze these figures after the event as well so if you put this together the first video and the first bit of uh, how to look for these bargains the second video of what to look for and you need to do this at least monthly you need to give it a month data though to get enough data but then you should really look at it monthly you can really get some idea and feel for it uh, use the filters and things like that on here there's no need for me to add this as a spreadsheet this is exactly how it comes out of Google anyway other than the fact I've trimmed off the last two columns because I don't use them okay hopefully you found some value in that uh, 
how to find good keywords and how to see if they're as good as you thought they were after a month of trying them. Uh, Squittydemondemon.com, signing off. <laughs>